Hey everyone, welcome to Comics with Bueller. As always, I'm Bueller. Today's your preview video for all the new comics coming to comic shops and online. For April 10, 2024, we've got about 200 books to show you guys today. Everything from Boom, Image, Marvel, Dynamite, you name it, we got it. If you're new to our channel, do me a favor, subscribe right now. It does help us out quite a bit. Okay, really cool announcement. Something you guys have been waiting for. And let me tell you what's going on. So yes, my old co-host Bob, Bullseye Bob, and myself are going to be filming a traditional comics and coffee episode and we're going to be doing that over the next week or so so if you guys are familiar with that what we do on those shows we pose a question and you guys answer the question here in this chat on this video so let me tell you guys what the question or topic is going to be what is your thoughts on whatnot now that's been in our uh, comic community now for a few years do you think it's helped the comic book uh, industry or do you think it's hurt the comic book industry please leave your comment down below and some of your comments will be used in that show the uh coffee and comics episode that we're going to do next so like i said what is your thoughts on whatnot has it helped or hindered or hurt the comic book industry i want to know hold nothing back be as brutal or positive as you want it doesn't matter because you guys are always represented on the coffee and comics show Okay, so join us, leave a comment down below. Like I said, it's probably not going to be this coming Monday, but the Monday after that one will air, so you'll have time to leave a comment on here. Also, do me a favor, if you guys haven't checked out uh, Comics on Coffee, please do so. And you can go to their website, enter the code Bueller, you save 15%. If you have had their coffee before, let me know in the comments. If you haven't tried it, go try it. It's really good. And use that code Bueller 15% off for you guys. I don't get a kickback that's just for you guys. And some of you guys are forgetting to use that code. And I'm trying to get you guys to save a little bit of money. So use the code, get some coffee. And I've been rambling. Okay, let's go ahead and get to the books. And I'll see you after the video. All right, let's rock and roll with Hercules number one. Cover A by Dynamite Comics. Cover B for Hercules. Hanging out with horses and stuff. Cover C, saving some children. Cover D, there's a nice little image of Hercules. Next one we got is the Mulligan variant. There you go. Moving on, we have Jennifer Blood Battle Diaries number five. Cover A, watch out for Jennifer. Cover B, <laughs> Sweetie Candy Vigilante number two. Cover A and cover B. Look at this one. It's kind of cool looking. Cover C, <laughs> hello. <laughs> cover D, I like cover D and cover E. Actually, they're all pretty good covers, so my hat's off. And then some Thundercats, number three, cover A, Thundercats. Look at that. Cover B, that guy. Cover C, that's the Declan Shelby. He's the writer of the book and did the cover for that one. Cover D, I believe that's uh, Ron Lim, if I'm not mistaken. No, that's not Ron Lim. Jay Lee it is. Cover E, cover E, there you go. Cover F, the action figure one. And, of course... None other than the Rob Liefeld variant. Hey, Rob, you're doing a good job on these Thundercats. How to give you credit. The Hubbard variant. Action Comics number 1064. Cover A on the DC and cover B. Do me a favor, like I said at the beginning of the video. Check out Comics on Coffee. Please do. It's good coffee. And use that code Bueller because you save 15% on your coffee goodness. If you've had their coffee before, let me know in the comments down below. If you haven't, what the hell are you waiting for? It's good. Get the uh, uh, Batman one. That's my favorite. Okay, next one. We have uh, Batman First Night, number two, cover A. Cover B, this is by Dan Jurgens, my good buddy Dan Jurgens, who put me on the cover of Red Sonia. Cover C for that one. It's a bigger prestige style book. Batman Dylan Dog, number two, cover A, and cover B. Watch out, Dylan Dog. Batman and Robin. Number eight, cover A. Cover up B for this one. A lot of Batman goodness this week. Cover C, dinosaurs. <laughs> cover D, that's awesome. I wouldn't mind picking that one up. Batman who laughs. Cover E, one in 25, or the Joker who laughs. What is that one? I don't know. Batman, Robin, and don't forget about Howard. Number two. <laughs> Green Lantern, number 10. Cover A and cover B for Green Lantern. And we got a cover C as well. That's kind of a little plain there, but that's okay. We got cover D is a 1 in 25 incentive cover. 
Outsiders, number six, cover A. Can they come out and play? I hope so. Cover B, the Outsiders. <laughs> That's the Warriors. Red on the Hill, number three, cover A. And cover B, <laughs> sorry. Sinister Suns, number three, cover A. And cover B. We're doing uh, DC first this time around, so I thought we'd give DC some credit here. Cover C, we'll get the Marvel here in a minute. Speed Force, number six, cover A, cover B. They're they're really fast. They're not slow. They're, they're, they're fast. They're speedy. Suicide Squad, the Dream Team, number two, cover A and cover B. That's a cool cover. I like that one. And we have the uh, cover C as well. For there. There, the cabinet, number three, cover A on the image comments. Comics, sorry. Cover B for the cabinet. I'm getting messages. I hate... Fairyland, number 13, cover, I actually enjoy Fairyland, cover B, so I don't know what the hell their problem is, <laughs> Napalm Lullaby, number 2, cover A, that's what that says, cover B, I couldn't pronounce it last time because I'm not that bright, but I'm working on it, Phantom Road, number 10, the A cover, and the B cover, that looks interesting, <laughs> yep, Rat City, number 1, there is a B cover, but I couldn't find it, sorry, The Scorched, Number 28, cover A and cover B for the Scorched. What else we got on here? We got uh, St. Mercy Godland, number one, cover A and cover B, new book. Transformers, number seven, cover A and cover B. A bunch of covers for this. We'll let this roll. Like I said at the beginning, uh, the uh, Coffee and Comics is coming back. Do me a favor, answer the uh, question that we proposed or the topic. What is your take on what not? Do you think it's helped the comic book industry? Do you think it's hurt the comic book industry? Let me know in the comments down below. We'll use some of your comments when we film the uh, Coffee and Comics video. Looking forward to doing that with Bob. And if you haven't seen the Coffee and Comics before, it was the number one comic book show in the world for many years. And to this date, probably still is. So be a part of it. It's awesome. Okay. The Silva variant. The Mil Milne variant, I believe that it is. A lot of Transformers covers. House of Slaughter, number 22, cover A and cover B. This is Boom Studios. Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, The Return, number three, cover A. Where'd they go? I don't know. We don't care. I don't. Cover B, Uncanny Valleys, number one, cover A. A new book looks kind of fun. Cover B, Tony Fleece. Beneath the trees where, you guessed it, nobody sees. Number five, A and B cover. Very popular book. Dark Spaces, Dungeons, number five, cover A. Why the dungeons always got to be so dark? Cover B, look at that guy. D&D, &D, The Thief of Many Things, number one, cover A. That's Dungeons and Dragons, in case you're wondering. Cover B, and this is IDW. Earth Divers, 1776, number 16. The Assassin's Apprentice 2, number 5, Dark Horse Comics. Count Crowley, number 3, cover A. And cover B. The B cover is probably my pick on that one. The Tales of uh, Exandria, number 3. And Monsters Are My Business, number 1. New book. Aliens, What If, number 2, the main cover on the Marvel now. The Lopez variant. They're just hanging out by the water cooler. Perillo variant. The one in 25 incentive cover. The Amazing Spider-Man, number 47, the main cover. The Disney variant. Do you guys know what uh, homage that is to? Let me know in the comments down below if you do. Momoko variant, I do. The one in 25 incentive, actually one of my favorite books from back in the day. One in 100 incentive, there it is again. Awesome. The Zhang variant, that's pretty cool. The Lyrics Lee variant. Carnage number six, the main cover. The Lashley variant, man, people are texting me left and right, what's going on? The one in 25 incentive, that's awesome looking. Edge of Spider-Verse, number three, the main cover for that one. The Momoko variant. The Woods variant. There's a bunch of Momokos uh, this week. The Daniel variant, including the Ultimate X-Men, number two. We'll get to that in a little bit. One in 10 incentive cover. The one in 25 incentive cover. The one in 50 incentive cover. 
Fantastic Four, number 19, the main cover. That kind of does it for me. I like that one. The Masterpiece variant. We still got some of these trickling in. The Vampire variant. Not many of these this week. There was a bunch last week. So, The 1 in 50 Incentive uh, Virgin Masterpiece variant. Incredible Hulk, number 11, the main cover. The Vampire variant. The 1 in 25 Incentive. I kind of like that one. Invincible Iron Man, number 17, the main cover. Vampire variant, another one of those. And we have the 1 in 25 incentive. I like that one as well. Miss Marvel Mutant Menace, you guessed it, number 2, the main cover. The Momoko variant. I put an extra Mo in there. A 1 in 25 incentive cover. <laughs> Resurrection of Magneto, number 4, the main cover. The Maleve variant, that's a nice one as well. The 1 in 25 incentive cover. Star Wars Darth Vader number 45, the main cover. A lot of Star Wars this week. The Rebels 10th anniversary variant. Master and Apprentice variant. We'll get a, we're going to see a few of these this week. The Reyes variant. Reyes, Reyes. Close enough. The 1 in 25 incentive cover. The Segovia variant. Star Wars High Republic, number six, the main cover. The Lopez variant for that one. There we are, the Master and Apprentice variant, like I said. A few of those. The 1 in 25 incentive cover. Star Wars Thrawn Alliances, number four, the main cover. The Sabatini variant. The Master and Apprentice variant. I believe that's the last one of those for this week. 1 in 25 incentive. Moving on, Symbiote Spider-Man 2099, number two, the main cover. The, the Coca-Cola variant. <laughs> the Tan variant. We got a regular cola variant coming up soon. One in 25 incentive. Ultimate X-Men, number two, the main cover. The RC Cola variant. I like RC Cola. The Choa variant. Another Momomoko variant. The 1 in 10 incentive cover. The 1 in 25 incentive cover. Apparently the first issue had a new character. I think that's it on the front. Weapon X-Men number 2, the main cover. We got the Balzadua variant. Balzadula? Yeah. 1 in 25 incentive cover. These are all pretty good. Wolverine number 47, the main cover. The Masterpiece variant. They put a bunch of these on, on uh, this Wolverine title. The Clark variant. The 1 in 50 incentive virgin masterpiece variant. We got about three minutes left. The 1 in 100 incentive cover. The Suyan variant A and the Suyan variant B, the virgin cover. Not bad at all. X Men 97, number two, the main cover. The David Mack variant, I'd subscribe to Disney Plus again so I could watch the X-Men 97. Caught the first uh, episode. It's pretty good. I liked it. Looking forward to the rest. 1 in 100 incentive. The Kirkham variant. That's awesome. She's looking at a picture of me. Capable, number two, cover A and cover B. I've had this on before. It showed up on the list. I hope it comes out because it's put out by a friend of mine. But you never know. Night People, number two, cover A and cover B for that one. Some good independent books coming up here. Dragon Thrall, number one. Cover A, there's something wrong with your teeth, buddy. Cover B, get those fixed. When the blood has dried, number one, cover A and cover B. Interesting. Quested, number three, cover A, cover B, and cover C. This is by Massive Publishing. That's a uh, Zelda homage, I believe. The Crying Boy, number two, cover A and cover B. Man, that poor kid. Get him a lollipop. Unnatural Order, number three, cover A and cover B. This is Vault Comics. Pretty close to being done here, folks. Little Black Book, number two, cover A. Is your name in the Little Black Book? I know mine is. Cover B, A-W-A. -A. Dead Weight, number one. That's too bad. Still, number one, and last but not least, is Blowtorch. Bad Roads, number one, exclusive. That's it.
Okay, guys, welcome back. Hope you saw something you liked. Like I said, about 200 bucks, tons of good stuff. So here we go. Coffee and comics. We're going to be filming one. Here's the topic. Once again, what is your thoughts on whatnot? Is it good for the comic books? Is it bad for comic books? Let us know in the comments down below and we'll use some of your comments to help drive this conversation that me and Bob have on the traditional episode of Coffee and Comics. I think it's episode 154. And this was the uh, really popular Coffee and Comics. If you're not familiar with it, it was the best comic book show on YouTube. It still is to this date. People still talk about it. So if you're going to be uh, tuning in, it'll be on a Monday uh, in the early morning, not this Monday, but next Monday. And you're going to love it because it's really good and uh, people miss it. And it'll be my pleasure to be sitting next to my good friend, Bob, and bring you guys another episode of Coffee and Comics. So, all right, guys, that's all I got for you. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And don't forget to get that to coffee from Comics on Coffee and use that code Bueller. You save 15%. That's all I got. Don't forget to live your best life. You guys know what to do.